play of the first quarter. He hasn't played yet. Eckler's in the backfield. That's Allen in motion. They shovel it to him. Allen running to his right. And he's knocked out of bounds near the 30. Let's go to JB and Nate in New York. We got a touchdown. Rivers to throw. Dancing in the pocket. Middle of the field. He's got Allen. And his second reception of the day up to the 32-yard line. Howard was in on the coverage and the, the tackle. You could see Phillip Rivers looking over there, trying to determine exactly what the coverage is, understands where the hole in the zone is, and then goes right to his favorite receiver in Keenan Allen. A beautiful pass by Phillip Rivers. And when you talk about having the answers to the questions, when he knows what you're going to do, he knows exactly where that hole is going to be in the zone, can float it in there, and it's an easy completion. On first out from the 31. Under nine minutes to play in the first half. And there is Allen wide open again. A flag comes in as he's inside Dolphins territory. One man to beat. He'll go in. 69 yards. But who was the penalty I against? think this one's coming back. I think they're going to call offensive pass interference against Keenan Allen. He kind of pushed off as he got to the middle of the field. Pass interference, offense, number 13, pushed off the top of the route. 10-yard penalty, repeat, first down. Well, good call, Jay. Bring Keenan Allen all the way across the field. Now watch right here in the middle of the route, right there. Mm. Not a lot of contact. Now there's the flag it went. But he runs straight into him and yeah. hits him, and they're going to call it because that's where the ball goes. Is that what you see, Gene Steratore? Yes, I do, and here's why, guys. Although the defensive back puts the arms up to kind of begin the initiation of contact, Keenan Allen then, then lowers that left shoulder and drives through that defensive back, which by rule now is the offense creating that and initiating that force. That's why they went with offensive pass interference on yeah, the play. That's a good call. The loss of one. Looks like a down the 11. Rivers underneath Allen. On a wide receiver screen to the 37-yard line, Taco Charlton with the tackle. Being active today. There's Keenan Allen in the slot. Slot to the right. In motion was Davis lined up to the left. Off the play fake, Rivers to throw. Throws to the right, he's throwing it away. Intended for Allen, it'll be third down. Keenan Allen arguing, he, he wanted a call there. Came off with his slow release and then try to set the DB up. He doesn't know which way he's going to go. Try to come and run a little out route. Second down at 21. Rivers throws to the slot. Pass is complete to Keenan Allen. And Allen curls up to the 32. A yard shy of the first down. McMillan in on the coverage. A gain of 20. A good job by Phillip Rivers. Just layering this ball in there. Looking at Keenan Allen the entire way. Right over the linebacker. Derek Watt, he's in motion for the Chargers. There's Keenan Allen lined up, man-to-man -man coverage. Rivers dumps it off. He's got Allen. Holds the ball with one hand. Going through the pylon. He's knocked out of bounds. Close to the one-yard line. Really creative play by Ken Wisenhunt. All game long, they've been bringing him behind the line of scrimmage. They bring him this way, and then he flips right back out. Try to get Keenan Allen the ball in space. Pretty good job by Xavier Howard, recognizing that, getting back out there, and pushing him out of bounds. Reserve, they're hopeful they could bring them back. You could bring back a couple of guys from injured reserve, but they got to get healthy. Well, that's it. The Chargers will run out the last 30 seconds. Phillip Rivers and the rest of Los Angeles will leave Miami with a victory.